Team 4 and 5 went pretty well. Was my cord plugged in? No. No. But there's a cord here. Give it you any? Mario! I don't Yeah. 
got the Chrono Snake as always and the Shoe Mario. The Shoe Mario cooks. It cooked me pretty damn hard. Good back air. Balls. Good commentary man. Good patience with the shield. Make sure not to get hit by any of the grenades or anything like that. Sometimes it's good to trade with grenade because then you get popped out of the way, but like most of the time you don't want to have to take that extra chip damage. 
Because that still gives Snake's like Snake a lot of advantage. Especially with how easily he can kill you if you choose a wrong option. Like you just want to make sure you're at the lowest percent possible. Um, but Mario on the other hand, very combo heavy character. And Chu knows those combos. He also knows how to get shit off of grenade. Which is funny. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Had to wait. Waited for Chronos to drop the shield, then do that. Ooh, yeah, okay. That literally covered, like, every option. <laughs> yep. We're back to even game. Counter City is in FD mode. Wonder who this is gonna be a benefit. Now it's in Kalos mode. Those side platforms are so scary to get grabbed off of by either of these characters. Because you get thrown at such a weird angle, and then you're so close to the back blast zone that, like, literally anything will kill you. Ooh, yeah, that was a perfect C4. Placed right in the way of where... I almost wanted to be. Or as she wanted to be. to the same stage, same characters. Ooh, yes. Yeah, both these both these players have really good grenade play. Kronos especially because he mains the character, but Chu can't be counted out because Chu has played Kronos billions of times. So she knows how to use his grenades against him. Oh, that is a scary position to be in. Oh my goodness. <laughs> She reflected the mortar and then it didn't hit her because it became hers. That's awesome. <laughs> grenade. Yeah, that's another thing you got to be careful with grenades. Is grenades are good at like if you hit shield, then they explode. Even if you're shielding with a grenade, so then you just can't touch shield at all. Oh, oh, miss tech. Go for the double up smash. Not gonna get hit. Ooh, a very good stall waiting. Oh! <laughs> She's not going for the up -y. Instead, to hit with the damage. Good roll into up tilt. Definitely calls you out on being close. Oh. The rebound, the basketball. Oh. Snake jab is the future. Oh, no. Oh, my. That's a sad SD to see. Not impossible, though. Mm. Really? Okay, she went for Nair. I would have gone for back air. But that's because I'm a worse player. I guess back air doesn't... Like, it hits, but it doesn't, uh... Does it hit? Oh. Hmm. Dash attack. Ooh. I like that, a tomahawk attempt, but... 
Just a little bit misspaced, so she didn't get the grab. Mm, good roll away. Knowing that Kronos wants this jab, or the, these grabs to get extra damage. Ooh, yeah. Putting pressure on her in the corner. Ready to roll out to get out of the pressure. And then just up tilt. Mm, yep. Kronos is doing a really good job of rolling out at these, like, perfect times so that the grenade just hits you instead of himself. Um, that is the funniest thing. Oh, man. That was kind of sm That was smart. Here we go, game five. Switching over to Smashville. This is Shu's counter pick. I'm guessing Chronos Band, Battlefield, PS2. I don't know what the last one would be, but definitely those two, because those two are very good for Mario. Ooh, ooh. Get hit by his own grenade. Ooh, good strings. Not gonna be able to uh, extend that any further because there's no platform on the sides, unlike with PS2 and Small Battlefield. With Smashville, you've got a bigger platform, but it's in the center, so it doesn't really... Like, you gotta get them in more specific areas to actually get the Ma Mario Ladder combos. Whereas on, like, PS2, there's, like, four places. Here, there's, like, two. Yeah, but the... Ooh, grabbing the grenade, shielding, and apply pressure. Seems like Kronos is just comfortable sitting on that top platform, just putting down grenades, putting down C4, making sure that, like, if you come up there, it's a danger zone. And that's tough for Mario to deal with because he's so stubby. Um, especially because every interaction you have, you, like, hit an up air, and there's, like, a chance that you're going to trade with grenades, so then it's not a positive trade for you. And then you're losing. So you have to catch him out without getting hit by grenade. But Kronos is making sure, is doing a good job of making sure that there is always some explosive on him, ready to get him out of any disadvantage that he needs. Going high. Oh yeah, calling out that air dodge. Ooh. Seems like Kronos is more willing to be on the ground now that he's down a star. We're willing to fight. I th what? what? Okay, never mind. I thought wrong. Good air dodge. Immediately get back to ledge. Don't let uh, Shu have time to react. Ooh, she's stickied. This might be a problem for Shu. Yep, she's opting to just... Ooh. But opting to like go off stage and just sit off stage with C4 on you is not a bad idea because it sends up always. So by being lower, you'll die less early. You'll still take damage though. That's not gonna kill, but. Ooh. I believe that was either supposed to be Nair or Ford or one of the two. But. Oh, he's got it on his shoulder. Oh, now she's got it on her forehead. Now Kronos has got it. That's one thing in this matchup I could never do is keep track of the C4. Snakes put it down and then just like, I can't see. Oh, he almost died to his off nade. He almost died to his own nade. Okay, yeah, that was, that was a frame trap. If he air dodged down, that was just guaranteed. All right, the Mario bread and butter. No, see, there's that grenade coming into effect again. Chrono's getting out of disadvantage because he had a grenade while shielded. Oh. I was really worried that was going to be an SD, but nope. Alright. Uh, it's Coast Man. It's the other one. It's the big one, not the smaller one. Uh, I think 
C4 is still on. No, I think it fell off. I don't remember though. I can't tell. Like I was saying, it's so hard for me to tell. It just goes invisible, and then I'm like, where to go? Ooh. Oh, I've spotted the C4. Okay. That took me way too long, and I, I didn't recognize where he set it down. Ooh, that was a scary position to be in. Either one of them. Yep. Sitting on platform. Ooh. Okay, I'm in here for that What'd one. What you trying to do? No, I'm just stupid. That's all. Yeah, I'm just stupid. That's all. I knew it was there. I just jumped yeah. in here like an idiot. Mm -hmm. Alright.